chicken wire is awful. Awful, awful, awful. And when you have baby rabbits who could squeeze through, not a good combination. So we, what we need to do is actually take off the chicken wire and put on this uh, smaller wire. Uh, if nothing else, it'll at least put me at ease and we're not gonna lose some rabbits <laughs> going through the wire. So that's what we're, what we're gonna do today. All right, so what we got here is just one side done. Um, so I have some chicken wire up here, which I'll probably, I will probably uh, pin it down here just to hopefully avoid any creatures trying to get in, uh, worst case scenario. But it's on there, I'll probably put some more nails in to make it a little more um, firm there. But it's look good so far. trying to eat. I could have shown this, but th th these were pointed out. Um, and so I had to cut right here on the wire so I can put it here. I'm gonna nail those down. But especially with young kids, you don't want them to be bleeding. <laughs> so that's, an, it will happen. So cut that and it should be look looking good. All right, so I originally made this. I essentially made, we'll call it a shortcut. <laughs> um, I think I essentially just wrapped it around and I didn't add enough uh, support here. I'm gonna see if we, I know we do, I'm gonna make, add another beam here. I'm not watching the camera, um, here. Uh, I think that will help. Oh yeah, I'm putting this guy up. And then we're on to the final wire. Last one. Ow. You always hit your finger with him, right? cage over it's been almost 24 hours let's see how it turned out it's working there's cookie oh hey oh somebody wants to eat i'm gonna say no <laughs> looking overall i'm pretty happy with it 